everybody. Carla here on day five of the Juice Fast. It's kind of amazing to already be on day five, letting me know that this 40 days is going to fly by really fast. And I'm thinking about extending it, but let me just see where I am for right now. Um, feeling really good, feeling positive and energized, and my energy is up. I can feel the difference in it. And But something that really made me feel so much better today was this call that I got from my father. And just to give you a little bit of history, uh, maybe about two weeks ago, my father comes up to see me, we hang out for the day, and I show him the documentary of Fat, Sick, and Nearly Dead. Now, last year, he had had some heart complications, had a stroke, almost passed away, and it was a very scary time for my family. And so now he's on a bunch of different medications and, uh, and making a really good progress in his health, but he wanted to kick it up to the next level. So I said, well, why don't you just start juicing? And he came by, I showed him the documentary Fat, Sick, and Nearly Dead, and he was really inspired. And that day I gave him my juicer and said, hey, go for it. Gave him a taste of this really awesome sweet potato, carrot, pineapple juice that I make. So delicious. He loved it, decided he was gonna go for it. So a couple weeks passed by and he's you know, kind of juicing here and there, nothing too heavy. But this morning he calls me and he says, hey, Ka, I made the best juice today. He made beet, carrot, plum, grape juice. Now, the amazing part of this story is not that he made the juice. The amazing part of the story is that my brother, an absolute carnivore to the soul, drank the juice and loved it. Now, my brother, I, I call us the Wonder Twins because we're essentially the same person even though we were born 17 months apart. But my brother does not drink anything that is not some neon color like electric blue or that really hot orange and wrapped in a Gatorade bottle. If it doesn't say Gatorade, he ain't drinking it or a Mountain Dew or something like that. It's always going to be some strange neon color. So for him to actually drink the juice and like the juice, that is amazing. <laughs> Absolutely amazing. And it's really on it's really interesting when your family comes on board with the things that you're doing. My mother had called me a couple weeks ago to say, you know, can you juice cauliflower? I said, I don't know. I've never tried because I don't particularly like cauliflower, but you know, can you juice it? Not sure. So what she ended up doing is throwing it in her smoothie in the morning. She had um it was cauliflower, peach, and then something else that she added to it. I will ask her for that recipe. But she said it was delicious. She said you almost don't taste it. So you're getting that juice, you're getting that vegetable in your morning smoothie without really tasting it. There are lots of vegetables that you can kind of disguise with other things to get those nutrients in there. So it's just really cool when your family comes on board. Uh, I had posted on Facebook this picture of my morning juice kind of before I made it so it was all this spinach and apple and pear and and ginger and parsley and my aunt in Boston sent me a note that said oh this looks really good just want to make sure of the ingredients because I'm gonna try this too now a couple of months ago she was like if it's green I ain't drinking it but now she's willing to try it I just think that, that is so miraculous and I just believe that you know the family that juices together stays together so this video is for my family to thank them for the support to thank them for the encouragement and to thank them for their examples of the juice that is making a difference in their lives too so hooray for my family hooray for day five I'll see y'all tomorrow